and continuing my campaign as High Chief Savada Polk of the Novogorod. Um, this is the second episode in the series so far. Uh, just about, uh, looks like I just got married to Steph Stephanie and uh, decided to take the additional prestige from not asking for money. Uh, as I have negative 70 prestige, that seems like a pretty, pretty good idea. <sighs> Pointing a bunch of people. Seem like I'm missing a lot of uh, chancellors and stuff right now. Interesting. Pick a new focus. I don't remember what I picked as I recorded this uh, over a week ago now, so have to bear with me. In the Roman Empire in the East, Byzantines, Christianity's full bulwark against uh, infidels, blah blah blah, is failing. Oh no. And I'm pretty much further east than that anyway, so they don't really do much for me over here in Russia. Still trying to figure out what I want to do. Might be leaning towards war. Let's see, what do I pick? I don't remember. War it is. And the Knights Templar, looks like I don't have a good feeling about that. And the Knights of St. John, I also don't have a good feeling about that. So I need to pick an ambition. Amass wealth, paragon virtue, become king of the roost. That's what I choose. I think we'll see soon that this is going to be even more impossible than I would have thought at this point. Due to some probably terrible decisions on my part. But it's still a good goal, I think. It's too bad I'm, I don't think I'm a pagan, unfortunately, because that would have been an ideal uh, ability to have. All right, finally unpause the game. I, I do a lot of pausing. It makes my games last forever. I'm just looking over my strength. Not really sure what my goal is here right now. Uh, I'm looking over my uh, claims, I think. Looks like he's stronger than me, so probably not the best idea right now to go after him. Checking out this guy now. This guy has a lot of titles. I'm going to guess that he's also stronger than me. Yeah, he owns, he owns a lot of land. Yeah, still kind of looking around for a place I can fight. I could potentially fight him. He's my brother, though. He has a lot of allies, many of which are probably the same as mine. I'm sure 
if I really wanted to take the time, I could go through and figure out each one of them, whose opinion would go with who, try to get a real solid understanding of uh, whether I could actually take that battle on, but I don't really have the patience for that. Uh, hmm, famous writer. Whoa, I'll make everyone angry. So I think I decided to give him the patronages. It's pretty cheap. Another claim. This guy also has a lot of the same allies, I think, as me, since we're all kin over here in Russia, it seems. like a little lull in the action, just kind of looking around, not really sure at what. This one little tiny army running around for who knows what reason. Oh, they're gone. Oh, that's right. Might be trying to fabricate a claim against this guy. He has like no troops at all. Yep, send my chancellor over there. Get to work. Rating sounds fun. Mm, strange man. Trying to convince me that he has the finger of St. John the Baptist. You look at it carefully and it does indeed seem to be a set of old human bones. Can't remember really what I chose. I could possibly become cynical or I can just buy them. I decided that um, it's worth the risk of becoming cynical. Looks like there's some people uh, raising some troops. Luckily not against me. I hardly ever know what to do with my religious figurehead. I guess uh, it's an aspect of the game I need to work on. Uh, usually when I played the Game of Thrones mod, I played as the old gods, the north, and there's really not much for that religion to do. It's a kind of a, either part of the game that's not well developed in the mod, and maybe they're going to add more, or maybe they just don't know how to spread the religion of a bunch of trees. <coughs> Let's see. I'm not really sure what I'm looking at now. I guess maybe I'm just looking for more targets. I try to grow my realm. Yeah. Well, whoever that is, they got a pretty big army. 6,000 men. It's a lot more men than I could put in the field. I think it's about double. Looking over my armies again. Definitely found that uh, I didn't really know exactly what to do my, with myself early on in this game. It seemed like a lot of my neighbors who I really wanted to uh, attack or I had claims against were kind of stronger than me. So that's not really an ideal situation. Looks like there's some uh, rebels down there in Bryansk now. A bunch of these guys are independent tribal chiefs, apparently. It's kind of a new thing for me to deal with, too. Uh, last time I played the base version of the game, I didn't have the, uh, the downloadable content packs that enabled this kind of stuff, so... Got some stuff to learn this playthrough.
because I'm just looking over diplomacy. Not really sure what I'm doing. Because that's part of the fun of uh, not recording the sound when you first play. I actually meant to, but uh, apparently I didn't have things hooked up right. So I talked to myself for a couple of hours while I was playing, and none of it got recorded. So that's always fun. Looking at my allies to, uh, I think I'm trying to figure out how to make some of them like me more, I think. It's always good to have people that uh, want to send you armies to help you out during a war. I guess I'm just kind of looking at my plot options. I don't know. All right. Uh, Slavic uprising. Interesting. It looks like I'm Russian and not Slavic. I guess that's an interesting thing to uh, keep in mind. So I always thought that Russia was the protector of the Slavs, but I guess Slavs and Rus Russians are different. Which I guess I did know from when I studied Russian history in college. Uh, still kind of just seem to be doing a lot of random stuff, so I can understand if you probably got bored of this episode. Not really too much going on currently. I never know what to do like with this game because there's always like so many little decisions that you know could be important for somebody watching but it's also a lot of uh, potentially boring sections because if you have any ideas let me know um, always looking for ideas to make the stream better